Good morning, Eastview. I'm Joel. And I'm Carrie. Get ready for the forecast. Debate team will be holding a meeting Tuesday, October 18th, after school in A300. Anyone interested can still join and is encouraged to come. The girls varsity cross country team finished seventh overall in the South Suburban Conference this past Friday. Special mention goes to Hannah Schwartz, who placed 18th overall with a 5K time of 2014. Good job, girls. And now a recap of our super fans. The super fans supported the Eastview football team as they took on South this past Friday. The score going into halftime was 14-0, but the final score was 21-0. Next game will be this Wednesday at 7 at Burnsville High School. Go out and support your Lightning. There will be tailgating before the game. The girls varsity soccer team finished their season to a loss uh, after from the Egan Wildcats in the semifinals. The final score was 2-0. Even still, congratulations on a good season, girls. We now take you to the, fall, to the, key, the recap of the fall play. called Five Women Wearing the Same Dress and it is about five bridesmaids that all hate the bride and we all have very distinct and kind of funny characters all with their own unique backgrounds. I'm on tech crew and I'm a shifter which means like in between like scenes or an intermission and I put up the set and just work on that kind of stuff. This fall play that I'm involved in is called Lloyd's Prayer, and I play a con man who finds a boy who's raised by raccoons and naturally assumes that I can exploit this raccoon boy for money. The funnest memory was probably all the new people I got to meet along the way. Eastview girls swim and dive team scored a victory over Burnsville this past Tuesday, the final score being 93-88. to Their next meeting is Tuesday, October 18th at Hidden Oaks Middle School. Hero Club will be holding a meeting today in C350. New members or those interested in the genre are invited to come. Well, that's all we have for you today, Eastview. Have a great target day.